Hey, hey everyone, everyone. Welcome, welcome back, back to, to Five Minute Eats. All right, guys, today we have a little appetizer kind of item for you. It is an Indian samosa, but a little different than your normal pea and potato samosa. And this is from a brand we've reviewed before, but this item, it's different from your usual samosas. Yeah, exactly. It is the Chef Bombay Mini Chicken Tikka Samosas with tamarind sauce. However, we lost the tamarind sauce, so uh, don't know if it's good or not, but it has 12 pieces, medium spice level, product of Canada. We did these up in the air fryer, and that's what they turned out looking like. They're kind of a little flat samosa. Normally, it's like a pyramid. And I love the packaging from this brand because they mm -hmm. did it like a redesign, I think, a year ago. Yes. And it just really sticks out. A lot of their stuff you can find at Walmart in the freezer section. Mm -hmm. And I remember we did, I think, their chicken tikka um, um, rice. Yeah, and I think so. So that was pretty good. The meat, the meat was okay. Mm -hmm. But overall, it was a good product. And this one, guys, I don't think you need... Um, the sauce for it. I don't think so either. This should hopefully be, uh, you know, like seasoned enough on the inside. So guys, if you're new to our channel, basically we review everyday grocery items. So before you spend your hard-earned money, let us tell you if it's worth it. That's right. If you'd like to support this channel, the easiest way to do that is using our Amazon links the next time you shop there. All right, guys, welcome back. Our rating system, thumbs up, we buy it again. Thumbs down, we would not. So for me, it is a thumbs up. Oh, this is a very good product. And just like I said, I don't think you need the sauce um, that comes with it. I think we need a side of chicken tikka, the sauce. Oh, yes. Yeah. That think, would be awesome. Because the whole time I was eating it, I'm digging what's inside. Mm -hmm. It's a little spicy, but the whole time I was just wanting to um, uh, dip it in tikka sauce. Yeah. You know mm -hmm. what I mean? Yep. I think it would be better that way. I would agree with that. So, but, are, oh, are you still going? <laughs> the chicken in this is good. It's the perfect size. Good product. Okay. For me, it's a thumbs up. I guess I can't hide it anymore. This is a great product. I was very, very skeptical because we've had this in the freezer for a little while and I kept thinking, I don't know if I want to eat that, you know, but it really took me off guard. The chicken seems to be good quality. It didn't have any like weird bits or anything. There's some like onions in there and some other kind of little bits and bobbles in there. Overall, it comes together really well. The spices taste great. It really did kind of taste like a chicken tikka and you just need like the, the dip and sauce of that to go with it. Now, I would say it is spicy because it creeps up on you. Yeah, it does. But it doesn't linger too long, I don't feel like. Like I'm not still like experiencing a high level of spiciness. So guys, to sum it up, thumbs up, thumbs up. And if you guys buy from Amazon, use our Amazon link. The reason is when you do that, we get 10 cents, 50 cents, possibly even a dollar, which means we can continue to review things. All right, guys, that's the video. If you like what we're doing here, definitely check out our other channel, Food Prep Inc. And don't forget to give us a like and subscribe.